Mission of the 80th AMU for the Juvats is to generate combat air power at a moment's notice to take the fight north. We stand ready 24 hours a day, 7 days a week to generate combat air power. The 80th Fighter Squadron, or Pursuit Squadron back in the day, was instated to head out to the Pacific Theater, which is where we got our nickname, the Headhunters. Named so after the locals of the island chains around New Guinea for being known to help out down pilots. So they would look out for our pilots as they were shot down or crashed. The full slogan of the squadron is Audentis Fortuna Juvat. So fortune favors the bull is what that means. The Headhunter logo is actually the only logo in the Air Force with a person's face on it. And we've been able to hold on to that for its deep meaning of they were the ones looking out for our pilots. And that original drawing of the Headhunter was drawn by a crew chief. So that kind of ties the bond between us and Ops that back in the day Ops was creating their their logo and they looked to a crew chief to, to help fill that role. So we've, we've been there with them since day one. Gold is represented by gold medals, number one, so we try to earn that every day, and I think we do a great job of that here in the Juvets. Um, it's been a great time. Korea is obviously a busy, busy location, so it's cool to be a part of such a high-speed environment. What does the 80th do better than the 35th? Literally everything. We crush them in every facet. Panton is another name for a panther. It symbolizes strength and savagery. We went from a fighter squadron to a bomber squadron, back to a fighter squadron, and now we're about to get ready to be a fighter generation squadron. We were very prevalent in World War I, World War II, and the Korean War. 35th also had the last kill in the Pacific in World War II, so that makes it pretty cool to be a part of the Pantons. Our motto is engraved in every maintainer around here. It basically means to push the envelope and give it all you got all the way. So that's where push it up comes from. If you go around and say push it up to anybody, they're going to say all the way. If you never worked on the flight line before, you wouldn't understand it. But coming here to work every day and working with these guys, it, uh, it just makes my, my job very rewarding. Fixing a jet, seeing it fly, it just makes my time in the Air Force very well worth it. The rivalry is very prevalent. If you're not a part of it, you wouldn't really understand it. But once you're a part of it, you know exactly what we're talking about. And you know that we don't say the, the G word around here, it's yellow. We did win MPOI AMU of the Year two years in a row. So it's just another something. I take a lot of pride in putting on this blue belt to be a Panton. And I know everybody else around here has a lot of pride in being a Panton.